<laughs> what have you got to say for yourselves? <laughs> Do you think that head bob is saying hello? I don't think so. <laughs> it's cute. Strawhead, no, I don't think that's true. I could be mistaken. Perhaps there are certain species of mongoose that do that. Now, Strawhead's wondering if it's true that mongoose will see, feed their sick and injured members. I... Let me be careful what I say here, because never say never in the animal kingdom, and perhaps there have been one or two recorded cases of mongoose feeding their sick and their injured. I would find that quite unlikely. They're certainly very sociable creatures, and the troops or the businesses that they live in are very, very important to species like dwarf mongoose or banded mongoose. I personally have never heard of them doing that, and I would find it quite unlikely. They certainly are very good at looking after the young ones. That's absolutely the case. The whole group will actually be devoted to babysitting little ones. Maybe it's possible. I've never heard of it, but perhaps I'm wrong. Perhaps it's something that has been recorded. Perhaps filmmakers or documentary, ma documentary makers or researchers have observed it. I certainly haven't heard of it happening, but I could be mistaken. Wild dogs certainly have been recorded to do that, so I guess it's possible. I don't know. I've, I've, I would be surprised if that is something that happens regularly. Maybe it was a once-off situation, but I can't see them regularly bringing back food to older or infirm members of the group. I don't know. Perhaps some of the other guides have something to say on that matter. Maybe they have seen that. I don't... I don't think so. 